let's take a look at how to calculate the annual percentage yield known as APY. In describing investments in loans, the advertised or stated interest rate is known as the annual or nominal rate. The greater the number of compounding periods per year, the higher the amount of interest earned. Consider what happens to an investment of $100 at 12% nominal interest. Although the nominal interest rate is 12%, with monthly compounding, the $100 earns more than 12%. This is why many investment officers today advise daily or continuous compounding. Here's how these investments are really working. The annual percentage yield, or APY, or effective rate, reflects the real rate of return on an investment. APY is calculated by finding the total compound interest earned in one year and dividing it by the principal. This is actually the simple interest formula solved for rate R equals I divided by PT, where T is equal to 1. So annual percentage, or APY, is equal to total compound interest earned in one year divided by principal. We can see that the annual percentage yield is the same as the nominal rate when interest is compounded annually. However, it jumps to 12.36%, $12.36, when the compounding is changed to semi-annually, and 12.68%, $12.68, when compounded monthly.